things you can do this winter holiday season. It is vlogmas season. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Emily. You guys are the M Babes, and it is Vlogmas video number like six, I believe, or seven, one of the two. But it is Vlogmas season, and today's video is gonna be a really good one. I think it'll be really helpful for some of you guys, considering everything with Corona and like a lot of places shutting down again. And today's video is going to be some ideas of things you can do this holiday season that are indoors or like smaller gatherings and things like that, um, and just some fun things that you can do during the holidays and like must do things this winter season with your friends and family but before we get into this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe comment down below oh i just kicked my camera <laughs> comment down below and babes to get a notification shout out and let's get into this video if you guys recognize this you are a real one and watch my whole videos because this is in my intro it is literally the comfiest thing that i own i'm not even being sarcastic like exaggerating it is so soft like here feel it like it's so soft um, okay, so anyways, like I said, I'm gonna be giving you guys some ideas of things you can do this winter holiday season And I have like a whole list on my phone. So let me get to that real quick. Okay, so number one on my list is to Go see some Christmas lights like everybody loves Christmas lights especially during the holiday season So you can literally just walk around your neighborhood if your neighborhood has like some cute lights and stuff in their yard Or there's a lot of places where you can do like drive throughs to see like a bunch of cute Christmas lights. Like I'm actually doing that tonight. I'm going with my family to see um, a little Christmas light drive through show thing. So I'm really excited for that because that's just like so much fun and really gets you in the holiday season and all festive -y. So that is one thing you can do. And number two, ooh, I also just did this. It is to make Christmas cookies. Go to the store if you can, or if you have stuff at home, make some sugar cookies, get some Christmas cutouts, cut them out roll the dough yourself it's so much fun and it's really easy it's not as hard as it seems um or if you're like younger you can ask someone older to help you an older sibling or your parents to help you and then get icing and decorate them make them all Christmassy, and then eat them so much fun and this kind of ties into like my next two things you can kind of do all these at the same time but i honestly forget what i was just talking about so we're gonna move on to the next one which is Make some hot chocolate. Go to the store, get some hot chocolate mix, some whipped cream, maybe some like candy canes that you can crush up and put on top of the whipped cream. Make it super festive or like chocolate sprinkles, chocolate curl things to make it kind of like um, the Starbucks peppermint mocha. Plug my best holiday Christmas drinks video right up there. You can go check it out if you haven't seen it yet. <laughs> but yeah, so you can make some hot chocolate. And then the next thing you can do is after you made hot chocolate and cookies, you can have a Christmas themed movie night. What? What? You can do three things in one day. I literally just did this with my friends. Um, we made some Christmas cookies, we made hot chocolate, we watched Christmas movies. It was so much fun and it really got me in the Christmas like festive mood. And I don't know, it was just really fun. So y'all should definitely do that. It's a good time. Okay, the next thing you could do is like extra, like really, really decorate your house or your room or your Christmas tree for Christmas. Like this year, me and my family went all out. We got a whole bunch more Christmas decorations because like there's nothing else to do and like might as well make the inside of your house super Christmassy since you're going to be in there for a while. So I like really went hard on my room this year compared to last year. Like it's not actually that crazy, but our living room and all that, like I showed you guys in the decorating for the holidays video also plug in another video right there if you haven't seen that go watch it we really went out we got like a whole we got we literally got a rug that's christmas themed well it's just red but like it's christmassy and we got a whole bunch more decorations and all that fun stuff and we put up some lights outside i didn't show that because like we didn't do all of our lights this year just some of them but yeah so you should just really like hardcore decorate for christmas because like why not since everything is like inside you might as well make it extra festive since like you want to be in a good happy spirited christmas holiday mood so might as well go crazy on the decorations okay next thing i kind of said this earlier but it's just just go for a walk if you're bored like go around your neighborhood get a jacket bring your dog or a friend that like you've been quarantined with before or like it's okay to be around them and just go for a nice walk a stroll go, maybe go to a park just walk around, get some exercise, see some lights, like I said before, but it can be really fun. It's always nice to just go outside, get some fresh air, take a walk, and bring your dog good times. 
The next thing you could do is visit like local gardens slash parks, um, depending where you live, I don't really know um, if you can do that, but for me, um, last night we just went to Longwood Gardens, if you know what that is. Um, if you don't know, it's like a, it's a, one of the biggest like garden parks in, in um, America. It's where I went in my 19th birthday vlog. Wow, I'm just plugging all sorts of videos today, but if you didn't see that, go watch it. That's where I went, um, that's where I went last night, and they always go all out, like, during the Christmas season. They put, like, so many lights on trees, like, even trees that aren't actually in the park, like, just on the road by it, there's lights on them around Christmas time, and it's just so pretty. So we did that last night. It was really fun to see all the Christmas lights, and yeah, if, like, if you don't have something like that, you can literally just go to, like, a local park and go walk around. There's probably gonna be Christmas decorations somewhere, so that could be really fun to do with your friends or your family or your dog. Next, you could make your own Christmas gifts since we're at home and have time. Um, like my friend decided to start making candles and selling them. So um, you could do something like that if you want to. Um, or just like make your own homemade gifts for your family or friends because like since you have time, might as well. Really fun. My sister is making something as a gift for someone but I can't say anything about that because like it's a Christmas present and I don't want the person that is for to see this. So um, yeah, so you just make your own gifts. It could be really fun to like homemade cards and stuff like that or like paintings, anything fun. Homemade Christmas gifts are always really good for like your parents and stuff. They always love sentimental stuff like that that their kids make to like keep for a long time. So yeah, that could be a good idea. Um, another thing you could do is have Christmas themed photo shoots. So like get all festive for the holidays, go outside, take some pictures, um, or like go somewhere with Christmas lights, take some Christmassy themed pictures for Instagram or whatever you want, or like if you don't have Instagram, just to have the memories and just have some fun and taking Christmas holiday pictures. Or you can do it with your dogs. Get your dogs some cute holiday like attire, maybe a Christmas hat or like a Christmas sweater or vest or Christmas PJs for your dog and take pictures of your dogs. Could be fun, we did that to my dogs, so go do that. And lastly, you can do some online Christmas shopping. Since everything is basically online anyways this year, you can go shop for some gifts online, finish up all your last minute shopping. You can get some JD Fit attire with my code Emily Hughes to support me. It's not gonna take anything off right now. It was already active twice before, so it's just a support code for me, but you can still add it and it is much, much appreciated. They're having sales for like another couple days for their 12 days of JD, JD Fit sales. So yeah, you can do that and just get all sorts of fun Christmas presents. Okay, that's basically everything I had for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was helpful for you guys and maybe found some things you can do this holiday season that maybe you haven't done yet. Things you can do with your family, friends, pets, whatever. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below, and babes to get a notification shout out. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram at emilyhughes.underscore. I'm gonna do notification shout outs in the next video, so make sure you do that. You can get a notification shout out. And thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Bye, babes. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time.